what is up guys you're watching the simple designers youtube channel and today in this video we're gonna see how to accomplish the day 14 of the daily logo design challenge so today we have a request to make a cloud computing logo design inside Illustrator. so without further ado let's get started so as you see i'm inside of Illustrator here i'm gonna try to draw a cloud shape so what we're gonna do is select my ellipse tool and make a perfect ellipse then i'm gonna make a scaled copy of it okay so i have uh, two shapes i'm gonna try to align them to the bottom then i'm gonna dupe or duplicate this bottom ellipses to the sides um trying here to scale the the right one a little bit to give it a kind of uh, a nice size it's just a preference and now what i'm going to do is select my pen tool to close the gap then merge all the shapes together and swap the fill and the stroke and now we have this kind of nice looking cloud what i'm going to do next is to try to give this shape more dynamics so simply i'm going to select my pen tool and try to draw a basic swoosh that goes uh, inside of my my cloud this will give it the impression of moving, moving into the space. So uh, it's uh, a basic swoosh. So as you see, I'm playing with the pen tool here. So now that I finished drawing the swoosh, I'm gonna select all the objects and uh, select the uh, shape builder, uh, shortcut key shift plus m i'm gonna remove the unwanted part and only keep the the parts that i need as you see i have this interesting shape i kind of love it i dig it so i'm gonna give it a nice color i already selected a gradient that goes with this uh, logo so this is kind of a, a nice looking uh, logo that gives the impression of moving into the space and we have this swoosh thing that gives the impression of a speed and motion i still need to fix some points uh so i'm gonna round the this point to make it smoother all i need to do now is to drag my my logo type the name idea i think it's a fake name i don't know as you see this is the final logo but i decided to go with the second idea so i'm gonna quickly uh, press shift O then I'm gonna alt drag this artboard to the left to duplicate it and Try to play with it a little bit to play with this logo a little bit to to make the second idea Which I which I made actually by mistake. I also drag in this shape and I made uh, a nice looking uh, nice looking combination. So uh, Let's see how to do it. The first step is to select my cloud shape then alt drag it to the left alt or option then i'm gonna select this last one and i'm gonna press ctrl or command d to redo my last operation and as you see i have this uh, nice looking combination uh, what i'm gonna do now is select the illustrator as superhero which is the shape builder and i'm gonna remove the unwanted part so as a bonus tip i'm just holding alt and clicking on the parts that i don't need to remove them and so this is the shape i'm gonna give it some depth so i'm gonna go to effect and give it a, a, a drop uh, shadow also i'm gonna do the same thing for the other copies so i'm gonna select effect and drop shadow also for this copy so i'm gonna also select it and give it a nice a drop shadow as you see we have this impression of depth or 3d i don't know how to explain it but I dig this concept, I love it. So what I'm gonna do next is to give it a nice backdrop. So I'm gonna select the, the rectangle tool. I'm gonna draw a, a, a square, which is my background. I'm gonna give it a light, uh, a gray color. So that's it guys, this is my final composition. If you like it, make sure to let me know in the comment section below. And don't forget to thumbs up this video. Thanks for watching and as always, keep it simple designers.